Greetings YouTube, this is Jared with Onboard Blade Works and um, just figured out today that the heat treat is once again bad. Sharpened up this little handy possum and it was very very soft on the edge when I first took the grinder to it. Um, so that was my first indication. Also when I tried breaking the point off in the vise it uh, broke pretty damn easy. Yielded and then and then I flexed it back and it broke, so. Um, our heat treat is once again unacceptable. So we're gonna have to go back to our old heat treater and have them do it properly like they used to. Um, another issue is, is that everything is, when it came back from heat treat, it was all pretty rusty um, compared to what it ought to be. There's some pitting that I'm not gonna be able to sandblast out. And so, if I want to get the pitting out. I don't have to grind it, and I can only do that on areas that are flat um, or beveled with my belt grinder. I'm not going to be able to get into the inside hooks, such as on this tomahawk, where there's obviously going to be some deep pitting, like there was on this tomahawk, which I've already sandblasted. You can see it. I'm not going to be able to hide that with uh, Cerakote and I'm not going to be able to fix it unless I put it back on my machine and grind it off. I'm not willing to do that, so. More delays. It's like the the curse of delays for the past year and a half, or it seems. And um, there's just no end in sight. Anyway, hopefully I'll have a better news next time and these things will be heat treated again, but the right way and we'll make them as good as we can and then we'll We'll have some clearance on uh, clearance pricing on on these tomahawks, and um, then we'll start fresh again. So that's all I got for now. See you next time.